look at Robbie, see the little grasshopper. Sorry, I'm looking at those stones over on the on the infrared light. Just oh. put those stones in the background for interest. Just a tiny, tiny thing. It's millimeters in diameter. I'm not even going to try and put my finger close to there just now to give you an, an idea of size. Bright green grasshopper. <laughs> just thought that's quite interesting. Wonder what. Uh, not much going through the mind there, but a different way of moving around. You see how it's moving like that in the, almost in the wind? A lot of these insects, when they camouflage themselves, they may be sitting on some tree leaves or some grass blades. They sometimes do that swaying. I just want to see if I can get my finger close to him for a scale reference. There you go. And there he goes. <laughs> now we can have a look at those thorns as well. Just something a little bit different. That's the grasshopper, of course, I'm talking about. These thorns also a little dead acacia. Something must have happened to the roots. Maybe something ate the roots or damaged the roots. So it's now just the dead twigs and the thorns sticking around. Of course, those thorns, the purpose of them is just to slow animals down when they're browsing. And the most acacias with very tasty or very palatable leaves. And by having thorns like that, it doesn't stop animals from eating the leaves. It just slows them down. And that's all that they need.